All right, here goes part two of the Led Zeppelin lesson. We're going to start out with rock and roll. So this is an A chord right here, your A power chord. The first riff is... Okay, so you got your A chord, another A chord, then you got this C sharp here. So, two, five, two, four, and then you go to the three on that A string. Kind of pull that one off. So that's kind of one of those honky tonk riffs. If you did the whole measure, it would be. But you've held this three over into the first eighth note of that new measure, so you just end up with. Okay, so the whole thing. Same thing down in the D string. Back. A big E string. Back to A. Okay, then the verse thing is going to be this G note here to the A power chord. And that was a pull off three to open on the E string there. So it's. down a string. I'll put that finger down here like from a D chord. You don't want the bottom string on this. You just want a five chord here. But uh, sometimes if sometimes people use that first finger, they accidentally get that two down there. You definitely don't want that. So you want your D chord here. Do the C bass to that D5 chord. Same kind of pull off there. Three to open. You got this honky tonk thing on the E. We're gonna stop on a D chord there. Etc. All that, and you get your E. There, you know, some kind of D5 or D, however you want to do it, probably a five chord. Okay, here goes Misty Mountain Hop, A power chord again. You're gonna use a G and an E, and the E's octave. So that's O two O. Then we got this A chord. That's a D with the A bass. And that's like the A flat over here, the G sharp. So you're still doing the A bass when you do these other chords. After that, it's just D to G. All right. All right, next is Bring It On Home. We're going to be like E minor pentatonic scale here. We're going to do two hammer ons. So that's the A string O to two and the D string O to two. And the big E. We're gonna go to this G string. So we bend it up, bend it down, pull it off, another pull off on the two to O. So. Second time. Stays on that note. to do the octave you can come up here to the seven and the nine to the e there so that's a d string 
and then G string, and A string, seventh fret. So here's your tenth fret, B string, bending up, and then down to the eight, to that nine there. So that's the same as this, a higher octave. Okay, so. Okay, our next riff is going to be 9 on the D string and 7 on the G string. And then 7 and 6. Put some chicks in there. That's 5 to 6 on the D string. And then 3, O. Oh, so we got... Here goes Black Dog. We're gonna start with the power chord held out. And then he sings. And then you got your big riff. So the big riff, I like to start it with an upstroke. Because it's kind of like that, that note is like a lead in to the rest. So that's seven, five, six, seven, back to that seven. And then you got this five in the G string to that seven. So you might kind of roll that finger over. Then we're going to come up here, 7 and 9 in the G string, and then we're going back, hammer on, pull off, and then, so all together, and the end of it is in the D string, 5, 7, 7, 5, 7 on the A, 3, 5 on the A, A power chord there, so. Now the next part is the same type of riff starting on the big string but has a different timing to it. So where that first note, the first time, is like a pickup, the next time it's on the downbeat, so I actually play with the down instead of an up. That's how they connect. One more time. That's the same riff. Five, six, seven. Back to that seven. So that was seven, five, six, seven, five, seven again. Back to the five, six, seven in the lower note again. And then you're back. And then we got C to A there. And that's that fourth fret of the G string, so. A, C power chord, A. That time kind of goes to that C sharp there, so all together be like. A, C. Sometimes live, Jimmy Page would go. And you gotta give it a waiver there, that big, uh, taking that G to an A with a bend. Okay, so our next part is going to be A, G, A, G. A, G, A, C, A. A, G, A, G. And then G chord to D chord. And it's kind of helpful to do an upstroke for that A and a downstroke on the G.
but I don't think you can add, they kind of do live sometimes. All right, like and subscribe if you like more. Thanks a lot.